Hello everyone, this is going to be a very basic introduction into how to solve differential equations using MATLAB. I haven't done this a whole lot myself, so this is just a, a basic introduction to get you started. So we're going to start our script with the usual clear all, close all, CLC. We need to define some symbols, so we're going to define symbols using the SMS command. We find T, uh, C2, and C3. These are kind of going to be constants. They're given by the given by the solution method itself. So we want to solve this equation: dy over dt is equal to d squared y over dt squared. A very simple differential equation. So we're, we can use it using this line. We're going to use the dsolve command. We're going to say y1 is equal to dsolve parentheses capital dy is equal to d2y close parentheses, and these, um, I'm having trouble remembering what these two are called. Uh, yeah, anyway, so D, this D capital DY is this DY over DT, and the D2Y is equal to D, D squared Y over DT squared. So if we run this, we can run it, and if we look in our uh, command window, y1 is equal to c4 plus c5 exponential of t. So this is a constant plus c5 times exponential t. Now if we have boundary conditions, we could solve for what those constants are. So to do that, we can do this in terms of y2. If we know we're going to evaluate using boundary conditions, y, y of 0, so t is equal to 0, we have y of 0 is equal to 1, y of negative infinity is equal to zero. We can do y2 is equal to eval, this eval function, parentheses, d solve, single parentheses, no, parentheses, yeah, that, whatever that's called, I forget. Uh, d squared is equal to d2, d2y, so dy is equal to d2y, and then we're going to comma and define our uh, our boundary conditions. So we just define them the way we just did. Y of 0 is equal to 1. Y of negative infinity is equal to 0. And then we can look at our command window and we will see Y2 is equal to exponential of t. So obviously C4 was equal to 0 and C5 was equal to 1. And then this pretty command, I don't have a good example to show you right now, but if you have a symbolic equation generating in MATLAB and you want to look at it nicely so that it, it shows all the fractions and how everything lines up, you can write pretty and then the equation and it'll it'll be much easier to look at than just a string of numbers and, and kind of hash marks. So this has just been a very basic introduction in how to use uh, MATLAB to solve symbolic differential equations using specifically using the desolve and the eval function. But I hope you found this useful and have a good day.